what's up crew AC Gaming here and welcome back to another video this time I've got something you know might be a little out of the ordinary something unusual on this channel mostly because it's just gaming but I decided for this one I will just show you guys my 60 minute map challenge I guess or I would yeah it's yeah it's just a challenge um it was inspired after Israeli Idan had asked me to go to the two year convention for 60 minute maps. And I'm like, sure, why not? It'd be fun. And he also asked me to make a map. So I thought, you know, why not do that too? Well, uh, this one isn't it. I, was, I actually made this uh, previous one. It was uh, pretty bad. It was more aesthetically pleasing than anything. But, you know, it's just, it was all a big mess. So I decided to just try it once again. This time, actually make it better or make a 60 minute map better not just that one maybe I'll go back to it I'll think about it so um here I just combined two things that I like most from my experience in Minecraft so, and that was just parkour and redstone so I thought make a parkour map with a bit of a twist to it so like every time you'd go up lava would rise underneath you which was a redstone part you know, I thought it was a pretty good idea because it'd be more like you try to get out of a volcano. I tried to make this other thing where it was like once you start, the lava would just keep on rising, but that was just going to be too hard. You'd have to like do every single jump perfectly or else you just die. And I just thought, you know, no one's going to be able to do that unless you're like OG at parkour in Minecraft, which, you know, that'll take a lot of practice. No one's going to be able to do that. So I thought, you know, this one would be just slightly easier. And yeah, so the lava rising was part of where the redstone comes in. Also the joining. And actually I had done this map twice. The first time I didn't record it, but I did time it, which was like at least around 30 minutes. This video is uh, pretty much me just recreating it. And you're going to see me every once in a while go back and forth to this one and the la the first one that I made. Um... So I can like, you know, actually remember what I did. And other than that, there was nothing really much to it. But uh, I'd also like to talk about some other stuff, you know, some issues I've been having with my uploads. It was actually because um, I'm using my, my Mac and it's just got too many files on it right now at the moment. So I had to like make some, some I don't know, some alternate ways to actually like edit my videos, having like some different techniques to how I import it and everything, import, export, all those good stuff. And then, you know, once I do start like making it into a file, I gotta like wait, which probably take me around like 30 minutes, maybe sometimes an hour. And after that, once it even does actually work, I've got to like actually upload it to YouTube, which would take me like probably another hour or two. Which is why these videos have been going slow, but I do have like three or four other videos that I would like to upload. Hopefully soon enough. Um, other than that, there's nothing really much to say, so you, know, you can just enjoy the rest of this video. You're going to see me using some MC edit, but uh, that doesn't work because I don't know why it just doesn't work. My Mac is just that bad. I've been hoping for a Windows computer one day. And I'm still crossing my fingers. Um, other than that, you guys can just continue watching. Maybe I'll add some background music. Uh, yeah, that, that was me just dying, testing it out. See, that's the lava working. Yeah, so I'll just add some music and I'll comment here and there. And I'll just talk to y'all later. Okay guys, so here you could see me going back and forth in the video, just, you know, swing from one map to the other. And there I am, MC Edit, see me trying to do all the good stuff, trying to copy. I tried saving it so that I could go to the other file and just paste it in there. That doesn't work, of course, because it just decides to crash. So I go back and I just kind of manually do it. I thought this was the easiest way to get it done, but 
apparently not. And they were just copy and paste it and I just kind of fix up the Y axis so every time you move up the lava would rise. You know this was actually kind of tedious but it was pretty fun. I liked it. It took me about, I don't know, most of the video, probably like 10 minutes. And there, I forgot to mention that I had to clone the actual map. So that way, instead of just having to reset it like by block by block, I just like clone one one map and I just paste it on again. So that way, it'd be just, you know, one one command. Which I thought was a pretty unique, pretty good. Also, I had to test out if each jump was possible, and trust me, that was not easy. I'm not, I'm not too good at what I do because I had to like estimate where jumps could go. I had to like test out if some of them were even possible. They all were, you know. Thank God. But uh, anyways, that was, you know, just it. And there I am, just copying and pasting everything. Also, I forgot to mention that I did mess up on one part. Right here, you can see that I'm checking all of these because I had messed up on that one right there. You see, you gotta double check your commands. If not, things like that can happen. Also, uh, I had to cover up this one, my one world, because that's kind of a secret mm, for later. I won't tell you what it's about, won't give you any hints. I just want it to be good. I want you guys to enjoy it in the moment once it comes out, hopefully. But I got some technical issues that I gotta work out. And uh, yeah, here you just see me testing it out. I'm really bad at this parkour. This was a pretty hard jump. Yeah, okay, you're just gonna see me like make this all in one go. That's where I had messed up. I put air, but like once you get in, yeah, I just want to cover style where you could just jump in, die, and just try again. See that now works. And we just gotta add the finishing touches here. We gotta, you know, thanks for playing, made for 60 minute maps, and then made by me. And you know, you can actually, uh, I found out this trick where you could just clone each sign or command by pressing control and then whatever button you have to uh, duplicate a block or item and that's it thank you all so much for watching if you did enjoy then make sure to comment like and subscribe for more and i'll see you next time bye